ways and motives of what they do and you know he take er, take a, everything to consideration concerning uh individual you know he it, it, it's important to know that and how he will bring righteous judgment to uh do toward, toward somebody but this oh goodness we got some crazy traffic y'all hold on let me see if i can crazy traffic y'all crazy traffic going on here so i gotta be careful all right um wait now it's first word i said was meaning that's where it's for real meaning is very important here meaning is the idea of things of course every word has a meaning y'all know that and everything well what you must understand if if like what uh king solomon says that there's nothing new under the sun you know what i'm saying everything that was established existed and it and if it and if it's something set is exists it has a meaning that's what people don't understand that the you know men is saying that oh you know coincidence and you know it just happened some kind of way and you know it just like you know your big bang theory you know all that kind of crazy stuff but everything has meaning everything that exists means something we supposed to be about discovering that meaning you know what i'm saying we're not supposed to define anything you know it's crazy that you know like i talk about the days of the week about like men not, like it does it, it it doesn't say in the bible that god told men to name a day it says that uh adam named the the animals and stuff like that but didn't mention about naming no day you know what i'm saying but yet, yet man is naming a day but they're naming something that god has established you know god established that and god's supposed to put names on what he established but if he gave you divine permission that you can name the the animals you know what i'm saying i don't know about the plants but he said name them you know what i'm saying that you need to understand that things have had a meaning and it means something to uh uh to understand meaning you know what i'm saying but the, here's the thing everything exists you know and everything is a word and there's a meaning to it you know what I'm saying? That it because it's a meaning to it, and it, it's supposed to be utilized for a purpose. You know, it's supposed to be utilized for a purpose. As you know, this coat was created for uh, to keep people warm. You know what I'm saying? This is what the purpose uh, of a coat. You say what? I say coat, and you say uh, I say coat, and you ask me what is a coat is you know what's the meaning of it? it's to help keep you warm it's that simple i can go you know everything an ipad ipad you know everything but now the thing is now it, it it has a meaning now what is the reason of why you utilize it that it, what is the reason why you should use this or use that what's the reason how you should treat people and things pretty much in a in a general uh standpoint what is what is the meaning what people means to you okay people means well human being means uh, a being is a person that exists you know it exists for a purpose that you know uh a, according to what god has created for us but men are trying to uh unfortunately in and of course we're you know born in sin in this wicked influential dark world system trying to say oh people are meaningless ah treat them like whatever you know what i'm saying uh you know dog you know, dog this person out you know what i'm saying say something negative about this person ah people are meaningless see that's the dark side you know what i'm saying calling people meaningless you know what i'm saying but the thing is you know uh this world system but 
people have a purpose. They were created here for a meaning. Hello, how y'all doing? Have a good day. And the thing is, they're supposed to discover their meaning in their creator. They're supposed to discover their meaning in their creator. You know, according to Genesis 1.26, you're made in the image and the likeness of God. But men has all this, uh, well, Satan, the God of this world, blind the minds of men, has got these other meanings that no, you're created to do whatever, whatever you want to do. Do this, do that, you know what I'm saying? Do this and that, you know? Y'all know all the stuff that's in this world out here that everybody's are putting their investment in doing this, becoming, uh, uh, coming something positive. You know what I'm saying? A police officer, a lawyer, a, a owner of a store, or there's the people are doing something negative, you know, becoming a drug dealer, becoming a prostitute, becoming a killer, becoming a bad person. But guess what? These ideals, uh, people are becoming something that will do something negative to somebody, and the people are becoming something that can do something positive for somebody. But what is the reason? What is the reason behind it? Is what the scale I am talking about that you need to understand that there's a scale. See, but guess what? A, a, a person is doing something negative right now because they was influenced a meaning according uh, uh, of course to this world system a negative viewpoint of the reason why you should do something negative that will harm someone else and put somebody in a bad position this is why you should make this decision this what it means to be negative and 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 and, and the thing of the thing about negativity is about the lust of the flesh and it's about pleasing a flesh that will, when it dies, rot in the ground. Yes, it will. That this flesh that you are trying to bring indulgent, indulgements in, you know, sin, are going to rot to the ground. You know what I'm saying? And 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 the, here's the thing. But as much as you uh, yield your mindset, or yield your eyes, yield your ears to this world system to let this world system give you meaning and give you reasons to uh, do something that is wrong as much as your performance are, is going to be leaned towards and you're going to weigh in your more likely uh, the Bible says judgments but really decisions you're going to weigh in your decisions of making these choices hey what's up long time no see I know yeah. I'm going to be around later in tonight I can yeah be Okay, I'm going to the club. I'll be back. All right. I'll see you later. Okay. Um, uh, you're going to weigh in these uh, choices. You know what I'm saying? You're going to weigh into uh, leaning towards and doing this negative idea. And, of course, at the popular reason of why people will do this negative idea, because everybody, the mass majority, sorry, not everybody, the mass majority is doing it. But there's a lot of declining of lives. There's a lot of death going on concerning the mass majority of the people that are out there. But yet people are Merry finding Christmas. a way to, uh, um, you know, do certain things, you know. And the thing is, um, they, 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 they're finding motives. Like, you're, like the influence of your television and radio and internet and movies and all kind of devices that brings influential ideas to do what's wrong. You know what I'm saying? That you will find a meaning in it within your flesh. Of course, Satan wants you to weigh this based upon your flesh, but not the spirit. You know, the spirit is gonna tell you, oh, this is wrong because this can, this, this, this well, see Jesus Christ, it, when it comes in our lives, he is the light. And the light is a driven force that is about bringing forth energy and bringing forth a, a light for us to see. You know what I'm saying? Like the Amazing Grace song, Amazing Grace song says, I was once was blind, but now I see. Now you can see what's going on and what you're doing with your life concerning the negative direction that you're going. And you can see the, the meaning the, the meaningless, pretty much, uh, the, of the ideas of this world system 
you can see the meaningless actions that you were in darkness in the position that you were in because you were following the you will conform to this world system. You are uh, you now have this light to see your actions and see the ways that you are doing certain bad things. And now you uh, that's what Jesus Christ is the light to help us see the uh, meaning uh, meaningless now to be about something that will bring meaning to you, and not just a meaning but a more more reasons to want to do something that is going to accomplish something concerning people will be about other people as you know the idea of the love of god is to love the lord thy god with all thy heart and love your neighbor as you love yourself it's about an energy that is about others you know what i'm saying god is going to give us an energy that will be about others and that will not will not be about ourselves which what the negative system of this world system of meaningless uh, 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 actions that is giving people reasons to want to do wrong, more wrong and more wrong and more wrong and death death continually happen. But the thing is um, that God is going to give us an understanding and more reasons to want to be engaged in this force that is come to bring life and life more abundantly. But the other one is sworn by Satan. It comes to steal, kill, and destroy you is what we must understand is scale is there that you you have a scale you have a scale that you know they unfortunately certain people's scales weigh in to do more negative than to do more uh uh what's right or what's godly what's of god and the thing is but there is a scale there see what i'm saying because here's the thing a person in darkness is doing darkness because they think oh there's no scale there I can only true only I can only con, con, continue to do more negative and more negative and more negative because there's no other force inside me to want to do you know positive you know what I'm saying that they will ignore in in the in operating in spiritual darkness but the thing is the scale will be there the scale is there and the scale weighs in everybody conscious and everybody gets you know people in darkness and in people and Christians too and Christians that are in learning stages in their development growth in God feel that weight of that scale you feel it and it will irritate you concerning you know the darkness that you're doing it's it's helping you see what you're doing it's helping people to um look at what your actions are about and you that scale it it it, it moves it and in this act it will aggravate people that are you know doing something negative when you start feeling that skill you think oh let me go buy a, a, a cigarette or get drunk to uh, take my mind off this you know that's going on inside me no that's that scale is aggravating because you see and you feel in the weight of the balance of the decisions that you made in your life and you know that this scale in order for things to make sense and things to get better you know that this scale of the godliness needs to be filled it needs to be you know you need jesus christ you need the word of god you need the things of god to um uh, uh strengthen the scale so this can weigh more and and this and then you need to get lay aside every weight lay aside all of this you know meaningless uh things that are causing you to do bad decisions in your life and get rid of this and put all the weight on the glory of God concerning God and that God is going to give you the ability and the strength to make you accomplish the things that you're supposed to accomplish through him not by power not by might, but by the spirit of the Lord that you can um, accomplish things and live life and life more abundant it's the scale that exists in everyone but it's going to the scale is operated in based upon meaning and reasons people doing meaningless things and giving reasons to it and those reasons in darkness they are called lies and excuses but the meaningful life is here this is about truth and execution or more likely truth in excelling you know what i'm saying you be you're about excelling things excelling at what you're doing instead of making excuses about things you know what i'm saying this is lies and excuses truth you're excelling as you know faith to faith glory to glory you know what i'm saying
press towards the mark of the high calling of God through Christ Jesus is excelling in here. It's failing over here. All right, that's the message. Understand the skills. God be glory to him. From an ever in Jesus' name. Amen.